Agus, get over here. I need some help explaining the ambush quick strike response to rigging. Hey, all you all, you Zed and Frog Meme Haggis, welcome you back to the Congo for a lightning round of unique Nile perch wrangling, unanchored using a Texas rig. Quick note, wrangling unanchored may be quick and dirty, but it's a tad less accurate, or so I thought. Retrieval accuracy and rhythm saves time in speedruns by targeting uni and trophy perch within a Nile perch school. However, unanchored retrieval methods and bass boat trolling gives a more random sampling of a fish school. For instance, during peak periods, a Nile perch school consists of one unique, one trophy, two or more regulars, two or more young. Nile perch schools take about 12 game hours to replenish trophy and unis. Thus, fishing unanchored is likely to result in more regular and young Nile perch. Until now. As my little buddy Haggis demonstrated earlier, Rigging mechanics triggers the quick strike reflex of predators like Nile perch, bass, salmon, trout, catfish, shark, and pike species. Quick strike is a sudden chow down hunt response present in all ambush predators. Frankly, I'm impressed that the development team included quick strike in the fishing engine. With rigging, you control interest in the lure with rhythmic movement, depending on how you balance the rig and skill in dancing the rig. You can get a uni perch to strike immediately or swim it up to the boat for quick strike and near instant retrieval. However, it's a little less accurate unanchored as the boat can drift with the current while the act of reeling in slightly pushes the boat backwards. It takes a little practice to do this. Holy cow, jackpot! The Texas rig was balanced just right for dancing the rig up to the boat to reel in a unique perch in record time. Now that you all know how to wrangle them unique Nile perch like a rodeo champ, let's see all you all break new speed records. <laughs> <laughs> 